installing the template to drill the holes for the servo mounting bracket. So I've got it clamped there. I've got it clamped there. The only issue I have is it's kind of held off from being perfectly flush because of the rivets underneath and the rivets in the corner. So hopefully it's not going to be a problem. Now the bracket itself goes like this inside there and therefore it misses all the rivets. So the drill guide goes this way and this way and it hits the rivets across here, hits rivets across here, and it hits rivets down here. So we'll give it a go and see what happens. Okay, I was able to fit an air drill. Let me see if I can get this. Alright. So I'm able to fit an air drill up inside the wing with the hose. Boy, is that dark. And then after each hole I'm drilling, I don't have Clecos big enough, so I'm putting in 1032 screws per the manual. Okay, we gotta put these pins on. Number 20 gauge, we gotta strip it just the right amount. Takes a round barrel pin. This is supplied by True Track. Should fit in just like that. Okay, should fit in just like that. This is a special crimper, has a depth gate, crimps it on all four sides. Just put it in, crimp it all the way. Perfect crimp. It has an adjustment for the depth and everything. So that's one. I just got to do it to all of them and then stick them in the DB9 connector. Now that we got all the pins on, we have to stick them into our connector, DB9 connector. There's numbers across here, one through five and six through nine. So red goes in number one. Just push it in and you'll hear it click. Now, what we want to do is we got one yellow one here okay we're going to take off this well maybe we'll try it with the tie wrap on what we want to do now is slide this loom up the wire and there it goes
because what we want to do next is get the shell under the loom. Okay, the actual shell assembly is a bit of a pain in the rear. You have to put these little screws in. Okay, this little bracket, this little bracket on the screw. There's a knot on the screw. Press it and get it out of the side. Okay, that one's in. Okay, that one's in. There's a little thing that's got to be now. You have to install. In case out for the shell out screws. Again. Always tight. Once you get one in, she's locked in place. So there's a nut in there. It's got to. Put the nut in. Put the screw in. The shell has a little tight on it. So the screw's tight. Okay, that's it. Now there's an actual screen relief. Put it on here. Put the little screw. Screw's going off the side. All right, so that's what the finished shell looks like. I put it on because once this is once this is mounted up there, I can't really get to this. So I want to put the shell on, mount this on, screw it tight, then mount the servo, which I'm going to do right now, which you can't see because it's up inside the wing.